you're expecting Heidi. You got me instead. I'm gonna try to do my best to fill in for her. She's on a much well-deserved family vacay and hopefully soaking in all of the sun. And so I'm here today to talk about all kind of like your spring trend report. And basically I kind of want to call it your spring formula update. So um, yes, you guys, I don't know about you, but I am so ready for the warmer weather. We kind of have like 17 fake springs and then we have real winter back again. And then it keeps going flip flop, flip flop, like all of a sudden it was 45 degrees on Monday. And now today it's back down to 20 degrees. And I'm like, I just want to get a real pedicure, a real manicure. I want to sit in the sun. I want to soak in that vitamin D and I want to wear all the things on this rack. So we're gonna have a lot of fun. Let's talk about what I'm wearing first today because this kind of feels a little bit like my outfit formula, spring formula, all through these, especially these next two months where my legs still aren't going to be shaved and they're still not tan. So I am wearing this awesome Good American. This is a little denim shirt. I'm wearing this size three and if you remember the size three is about a medium large, definitely more in the large size. And it doesn't feel too oversized, but you guys, the drape of it is like so yummy gummy. And then look at like all the fun little detail stitching in it. Absolutely love. And then I just gave it like a good roll so I can show you guys all the goodies. And then, oh, here, I'm, I'm gonna like tip into something else. You know what else is really fun about this denim shirt? Which this also can feel incredibly, incredibly scary, but this whole entire set is next to me. So I have to show you. This is a set, everyone. This is a set from Good American. Yeah, what? These look terrifying on a hanger. They have stretchy waistband, but also don't we love a stretchy waistband? Full on denim on denim set. You don't have to tuck it in. Kind of just wear the button down over the top and you're good to go. But you know what? To make it a little bit more easier, a little bit more approachable, I am wearing the AG Sage Wide Leg. And oh my gosh, tons of stretch. These feel so incredibly comfortable. I'm wearing a 10 in these, size 30. Like I definitely had to do like a suck me into button them, but then as I'm wearing them, they're starting to relax, feel really good. I don't feel overly exposed. And then let's talk about this crazy fun new shoe from Jeffrey Campbell. This little, this is their pool vibes cork. Like how comfortable is this gonna be? And how, how, how fun is this? And I painted my toes last night at like, it was like a midnight manicure. Once all the littles went to bed, then I quickly painted my toenails because the entire state of Minnesota was at the nail salon I tried to get into. So bear with my manicure as there isn't one. I just threw on, slapped on some lotion in my cuticles and um, all made it good. Okay, I'm seeing a note here right now. Fabric of the denim set. I don't know what the fabric is, but she sure is really yummy, yummy, yummy. I'm assuming it's like a tensile denim. I might have to have my crew. Here we go. Oh, I was correct. It's 50% tensile. And then we have viscose and cotton. So just that's where you're getting that really yummy drape. So the vibe of a denim, but not like the stiffness and the structure of denim. And it feels so good, you guys. So to me, a denim shirt feels incredibly important through the spring season, spring season, along with every other button down that we have in store for you. So I want to show you a few other great little woven button down items that to me just give you a little pop of spring, a little pop of color, a little pop of fun. I don't know, just to bring some joy to all of our things. It's a new one from Michael Stars. Check out this really beautiful little eyelet situation. Just a fun take on the white button down. Put a little cami underneath it, short sleeve, just feels really feminine. They're winter light. This is our, this is my fake vitamin D, which is totally fine. Um, this is the eyelet button down, Michael Stars. So pretty, so feminine. If you wanted to do a little like monochromatic look, this would be so cute back to these white jeans. So, so cute. Another really beautiful white top button down take. This is Cleo Bella. This was in our March um, Transcend um, image in our catalog. So beautiful. Check out the sleeve detail on this. This just feels like really beautiful, little, really pretty. In April, you probably have some events coming up and it just, I don't know, there's something about spring and um, just those feminine blouses that feel really good. And I love this little Cleo Bella. Again, really beautiful back to this white, white jeans, but I'm gonna show you some other options that we can pair back to it. So this is Cleo Bella and this is the Leo blouse. Okay, if you like a little fun, pop a color, pop a print. I got two of my absolute favorites. You guys, this is an every bestseller and 
This is the Laura Ruffle Tank, bra friendly, so beautiful. We have had this in, I think, three seasons back to back. We've had it in a stripe, we've had it in a solid. Now it's in this really beautiful floral. It is selling like crazy. This color is green. And then my favorite detail of the whole thing is this little button back. Like how cute is this? How sweet? I don't know, you guys have East, East, East. I was combining into one, East over. Easter, Passover, all the really like fun little events, bridal showers, baby showers, like throw this on top. How cute is this? Okay, and then if you want a little bit more um, coverage in the arm, this is the Eva Mix Floral Blouse from Ever Eve. How beautiful is this? Just a really fun um, pop, pop over, um, really fun little sleeve detail. This could be worn back to work. Again, really cute back to the white pants. I love something that's just like a little bit more formal, back to a little bit more scratch. I have some really cool denim that we can show back to you. And if it's really warm where you are at, you can even do this with a pair of denim shorts, which I got a few favorites that I wanna show you guys too. So this is really beautiful. This is from every two. All right. Now, I just wanna remind everyone, we have a very full rack today of all these fun goodies. I'm usually used to my Monday new arrival. I got my nine items. I talk so fast, I can barely catch my breath. So if any of you say, slow down, thank you, because I'm excited. I'm excited to be here for you guys. And there's so many things that I have to share with you. So feel free, just be like, slow down, Ash. Like, let's hear more about the product and take a deep breath. You're okay. Um, when I think about this time frame, this total, like in between, is it cold? Is it warm? This is massive, like transitional time. What else do you want to wear but a really great sweatshirt? That's actually what I wore into work today, which is an easy pop color sweatshirt and a little bit more elevated bottom. So I have three, I'm like, how do I, what do I want to show you first? I'm going to show you all three of them. Three little fun sweatshirts that just, I think, bring joy, feel really good to transition. Loving this floral sweatshirt from Every. This is the Cora Tropical Pullover. Like, what? How? fun is this? How cute? Like, again, I think this is like the perfect denim I have on today because it kind of goes back to everything. But check out all the really beautiful colors. I want to show you guys a little bit of a uniform. I'll get to the uniforms. I'm really excited about all the individual things and then I'll kind of get into these uniforms. But utility bottom, the new utility, being a really important item in your spring wardrobe, these would be so cute back to this. All right, showing you this next. This is the tried and true, Faraday favorite, bestseller, one of their best little like sunrise sweatshirts. This is the sun and wave hoodie. They do this over and over again. This is in a really fun slub knit that just is that great transitional, cool to warm um, little hoodie. Loving this pink because I think it looks beautiful on everyone. And then another pink option that I absolutely love. How fresh is this back to white? But again, back to that like um, utility color is gonna be really beautiful. This is just like a core easy toss on sweatshirt from LNA. This is the Jones hoodie, so beautiful. I feel like, okay, if you haven't seen the sun in 17 months, which is me, really beautiful on any skin tone. If you are like enjoying and grabbing that vitamin D, another really beautiful color. If you are living in leggings and athletic wear, this would be cute over the top of it. You wanna do it with a pair of jeans. Jamie back here, she's got her yummy joggers on because we're all still living in that. This would be cute, but if you wanna elevate it up a little bit with like a little, I don't know, amazing best-selling utility pant. How cute does that look? So this is just, I know it's hot pink and that can feel really scary, but I do find this to be a really fun core item. You guys, a hoodie is really cute underneath a little jacket, denim jacket, white, olive, denim, so good. So that really yummy, easy hoodie, good to go with these three. All right. When I think about spring, I think about stock up season because I have been wearing the same white t-shirt all winter long underneath a sweater, underneath some type of jacket. And I don't know about you if you've actually taken a look at it, it's probably pitted out and disgusting and not white anymore. And you're like, I need to trash and start something new and get a fresh one. So we have our amazing, perfect white tee tees. This crew is hands down one of my favorite basics. We have it in five, am I counting right? One, two, three, four, five, yes. Today's a Thursday, but I feel like it's Monday morning. Five really fun colors, crazy flattering, um, fits on so many different body types. I feel like it's like not too heavy, but not too light. Um, 
really beautiful neckline. The quality feels really good. I don't know, this is just one of my cores. I have it in the crew neck, have it in the V neck. It's just, I think the white is really beautiful. And then we have this like core heather gray. How fun is this really pop color of this peach? I don't know, this brings a lot of joy. Um, this is in the melon color. Again, looks really back, beautiful back to all these utility colors, cute back to white, easy peasy back to a pair of denim. And then just kind of our vintage black, which I like because it's just a softer than like the core dark black. It just feels a little bit fresher in this more washed out um, black. Is the white see-through? See, yes and no. I feel like I just do a nude bra with it, but I don't see like everything un underneath it. So it's a, it's a see-through where I don't feel self-conscious. It's just like a nod. Is that a, that might be a terrible answer, but I'm gonna say, 50-50 see-through? I don't know. It's like thick enough that it's not that see-through, but like thin enough that it's not. So that's my answer is 50-50 see-through. Can you remind them what shirt you're wearing? Oh, what shirt am I wearing? Yes, I can remind you because it's really yummy. Uh, this is the Good American. I, I was actual. I'm not excited. This is the weightless easy shirt. And I will tell you, it is easy. It is easy. It's an easy, easy t-shirt. So I'm wearing the size three, Good American. You guys look at the drape on that. How yummy is this? Just like not crazy long. So again, as a reminder to everyone, this does come as a set, a great little denim pant. This is a really great length that if you wanted to leave this untucked, kind of just like loose, it just creates really nice shape because of this little baseball hem. So it elongates the leg. It just has a really, I don't know, it feels so yummy. Loving the details and all of these like little camp shirt pockets. But I just threw this into a half tuck to show off these jeans. Yep, still sucking in, little, little untuck and then I'm good to go. And then I just threw on my pop of that Yoriana um, Turk necklace because I'm really vibing those like pop colors in our necklace stacks. Okay, where do I want to dive into next? I feel like I've been referencing this a lot, so I'm gonna talk about utility pants or the new utility. And I'm gonna talk about our best sellers from Sanctuary. So this pant, let me tell you what it is. This is the Rebel pant, we have it in three colors. Now, this has been a utility bottom that we have had here at Every for years. And we just keep bringing it back and bringing it back and new updates. And I will tell you why it's absolutely amazing. Holds its shape, really yummy. Doesn't, it has like a stretch, but still a hold. So it's still that great like structure. I feel the style with this Rebel pant for this year has a little bit of this like relaxed, cool, I don't know, the fit just feels really updated. And even though it's like in that same really great crop jogger, there's something about it that just gives you a little bit more relaxed vibe. And I'm gonna say relaxed 15 more times. It's like a drinking game. You just drink a cup of coffee every time I say relax, but you're good to go. This jogger, which I think is such a win, especially in the springtime, so no matter your footwear, you don't have your pants like puddling into the puddles. Um, it doesn't matter if you're doing it with a sneaker, which I have some really fun sneakers to show you. If you're doing it with a little like platform. You wanna pair it back to a pair of Burks. And for some of you who might still be <laughs> living in the boots i'm ready to toss mine out um you can still do it with a jogger and i think that's what's so beautiful about this length is that you can wear it with any footwear and the other thing i love about the sanctuary rebel pant is somebody who carries a little bit more curve through her butt hip and thigh and currently still carrying some weight through the tummy this has stretch still holds you in and i don't feel completely constricted so this is the rebel pant from sanctuary three colors kind of this washed black vintage black this utility green which I personally think you guys goes with every single thing in your wardrobe and I love this paired back to those like pinks pastels all those springy colors love it packed to those eyelets and then I'm kind of vibing on like bringing that khaki back in again I think this is a really fun little utility update like kind of love it back to the melon I don't know why and you can even throw the denim shirt this is this are you guys envisioning this right now unbutton the denim shirt throw the melon underneath throw that over the top of the utility like, look at this cute little uniform. This is this is your envisioning this, right? But I kind of love that mint melon back to the khaki color. Question. Can you tell us about shoes with these pants? Shoes with these pants. Yeah, so the question is, can you tell us about shoes with these pants? And I can, and I have a couple options that I absolutely love. So I'm gonna do this khaki color because I feel like this is something maybe you've already done. You maybe already had in your wardrobe and now time it's time to update it with a new khaki color. Is this called khaki or is there a prettier word for it? True khaki. True khaki is the more updated, really beautiful version of that color. So, one thing that I love to pair back is a great little New Balance 
support sneaker. So loving this new chocolate brown um, color. How cute would that be? A little no-show sock. This little um, true khaki rebel pant. And then actually, how cute would this be for run around with this denim shirt? So easy breezy. But if you wanted a little bit more lift, I have these little flat form, fun new version from New Balance um, in this really beautiful blush pink. Like how cute would that be with a denim shirt and you're set to go. So that is like option number one, which I love right now with my very pathetic pedicure I gave to myself last night. But one of my spring summer uniforms is the Burke. These, this, is this helpful? These are the new um, platform Burks from Birkenstock and that like clean white gives you a little bit of lift, feels a little bit more elevated. How fun would that be? Again, back to this little denim shirt, do a little white Burks, take this on vacation. So easy breezy. I also think, If you are going on vacation or you have spring break next week and not this week, which I'm sure all of you do because like I said earlier, the entire state of Minnesota was at the nail salon I tried to go to last night. You could do this really cute every top because I love a little bit more of a feminine blouse back to utility bottom. And then you throw on your Burke. Like how cute is this little combo for a vacay and takeaway? And then if it gets cool at night, you throw over a denim shirt. So cute. So. Those are some fun little footwear options that I would pair back to this. And then, actually it might be really cute too, just back to these little quirk platforms. Oh my gosh, watch me, like this whole rack's gonna come down. Back to this perfect white tee, these little platforms, and then this little true khaki. Like how cute, easy breezy, throw on a little bag, a crossbody bag, and you're set to go. So that's a footwear I would do. All right, white denim. I wanna to talk to you about this because it's something you're craving, it's something I'm craving. This also feels a really important item into that spring uniform. Is it a trend? Yes, it's kind of back again. And I kinda of wanna talk about the new ways white feels really important and it's in this more of a wide leg silhouette. So again, I'm wearing this Sage from AG. Crazy comfortable, it's sitting up nice and high. I feel held in, but again, a ton of stretch. We have our number one selling styles from Cut. This is the um, Stella High Rise Flare. So again, if you don't like something that sits like a little bit wider, maybe it makes your legs feel a little bit wider, the beautiful thing about the flare is that it kind of nips you in through the thigh, kind of brings it in, and then it kind of kicks out at the bottom. New updated version of white denim. Again, would be really cute back to these little pool slides. And then one of our best selling silhouettes from Citizens of Humanity is the Lila Boot Cut. We have this in a couple different versions of the blue, and then it's back in this really beautiful, which white, which actually has a lot of what's weight to it. So it doesn't feel like it's gonna be see-through, it feels really quality. If you're still in that like sweater transition where you still need to wear something with a little extra layer, white would look really beautiful back to your current sweaters. But what's new in white denim is this more wide leg silhouette. Again, really cute back to your Birkenstocks, you guys. Back to the denim shirt. This is, would be a fun little uniform. And then don't be afraid to pair it back to a sneaker. And then you could throw in one of those like little pop color sweatshirts, which would be a really fun um, combo together, especially in this transitional time. All right. Ash, would you suggest oh, yeah. a certain one for somebody that's more curvy and petite? Ooh, good question. So the question was, what, what jean would I suggest for somebody who's a little bit more curvier and petite? So actually, I might suggest the jean I am wearing. It has a ton of stretch. And one thing you maybe can't see from far away from here is it has a raw hem. So, and with it being a wide leg, it means that the hole from like the hip down, it's wide all the way through. So I think as long as we get this hem shortened a little bit, so we expose your ankle, show a little bit more leg, this would be a great option for petites. But I think one of our other like winner winner chicken dinners is the cut Stella high rise again another raw hem that you could kind of like chop to where it needs to be so if you wanted to wear it if you're more petite and you prefer to wear a wedge or a flat form you keep it a little bit longer but if it's somebody you want to wear a birkenstock and run around then you just kind of hem it to the top of the foot but the cut stellas have a ton of stretch you guys they're incredibly comfortable i feel like the silhouette is so yummy and holds you in through the waistline and the best part about them is they're under hundred dollars 
So sometimes investing in white can feel really scary and you may not want to do a big investment on it. So that's the fun thing about cut, especially in a white, is you're not like breaking the bank under $100, really fun option and a ton of stretch with these Stella's group. That was a really good question. Okay. What? Oh, can I show you guys one more thing? Because we're on the topic of cut. And then I also wanted to talk a little bit about shorts. So one of the big trends happening in bottom this season is that clean hem short. So we've had the really great cutoffs, but everything's just getting a little bit more elevated. So our like fan favorite, best-selling short from cut, this is the Jane, comes in some new <clears throat> Um, silo not silhouettes, but new styles this year. So this one really fun check out these fun little like pockets on the front This is a best-selling little item again Buy true to size in these jean shorts, but I love this little update to this short again cute for a denim on denim look Really easy peasy spring uniform pair this back to your perfect white tee Birkenstock you're set to go or Again vacation how cute would this be back to a really like feminine blouse but we also have the jane short in this little clean cuff um in this really beautiful white again best-selling jean great for somebody who has more curve and if you want that jean that's not too long but not too short the jane is like the most incredible length on the leg and incredibly flattering and the price point alone you guys is so good let me find it for you under 80 so really great short and so that Stella in the white also comes in our Jane short um, as well as all right one last big trend that's happening and I feel like we got all the fun items to talk about this trend and it is called sport court so if you caught Heidi's stories last Saturday she kind of did a version of sport court for real so if you're a pickleball fan or an actual pickleball player, if you play tennis, if you're a tennis wannabe, throw a heart in here because this is trending incredibly, not only like on the courts and in, you know, gyms and all the things, but it's also happening in fashion too. So I think the beautiful thing is we have this, we love fashion leisure, that kind of like it's athleisure, but it's still fashion. The fun thing with court sport is you can pretend that you play pickleball and like make it look like you do, but you actually don't have to do it. So, some really fun options in here. And I think the first thing that's really kicking off this sport court trend are the awesome little tennis court skirts. So if you remember last year, two years ago, the bike short was really awesome. I personally love it because I could go on a walk and I wasn't getting any chafing in between my legs. But then you're like, oh my God, I'm wearing like bike shorts and that's what I wore in volleyball in high school. And then came the tennis skirt and it was like, hi, just hiding all of your life through here, but still no shaping. So we have this amazing little tennis court from Spanx. Why do we love Spanx? Holds you in the curve of a woman. They know exactly what they're doing. So there's no riding, there's no tugging, there's no pulling. And then in these awesome little lightweight breathable fabrics, we have it in our great little white, which I think feels really fun and fresh. And then I love it in this classic black. And then in the waistband crew, it's gonna hold you in. So just, nipping you right in. And then what are you pairing this back for if you are physically not playing tennis? I am physically not playing tennis, but I'm gonna look like I am when I'm like walking to go get a coffee. We're gonna pair it back to this crazy fun new brand that we've just brought in called Salt Parade. If you got our March catalog, this is probably one of my favorite looks. If it wasn't the March catalog, it might be on our like social channel. How cute is this fun little Kelly Green stripe? You guys are going away again on spring break next week and I'm obviously I'm not bitter that I didn't book a trip at all even though that's all I want to be doing right now how fun is like little pink palm got the long sleeve you pair this with a little tennis skirt and then because you're physically not playing tennis you just throw on your Birkenstock and how cute easy just a slight nod to this tennis trend but a really fun fresh bright new way to wear it or you're like yeah no way I won't wear white jeans I won't wear white shorts I'm not wearing white skirt just get the black version in Spanx and then you pair it back to this really fun South Parade sweatshirt with a nod to the rackets. Um, and then like the little varsity stripe, how cute is that? Like it's a fun little nod, this you could pair back to a sneaker or again, back to your little Birkenstock. But fun, just like slight nods to the court sport trend, but really you might just be grabbing coffee or meeting with a friend or you're hitting the sidelines. All right, speaking of sidelines, some of you who are at the baseball tournament 
track meet, you already have your summer plans completely lined up and it means you're sitting in the sun watching a tournament of some sort every Saturday and Sunday and you know it's going to be hotter than heck. Or again, you're going on spring break. What are you packing? What are you wearing? You are wearing the most comfortable, friendly, weather friendly, bra friendly, yummy barley dress. We have it in two colors. Under 90. This is the Naples dress. How cute is this? So super lightweight, incredible length. Again, I know I mentioned Heidi's stories last Saturday. She is wearing this, so if you want a good read of what this looks like on figure, she has this on. She had it on in the black. This is the white version, which I think feels really, really fresh. This would be really cute. I'm like trying to think what you can wear it with. Again, you're walking around. I feel like everyone has been going to Disney, went to Disney, is going to Disney. How cute would this be with a great pair of sneakers, little easy peasy dress, you throw in a crossbody bag, you're totally set to go. Or if you're headed on vacation, or on the sidelines, just pair it back to your Burke and you're, you're done, you're set to go. But this is the barley dress. You guys, this has been a bestseller for us. I think last year we brought it back in again in two colors. This is something I would not sit on. And I feel like sometimes those basics where you're like, I don't need that. I have that. And then all of a sudden you start to go through your drawer and you want to wear it and you can't find it. And the one you realize that you had last year, you're like, actually, I don't like it. It like sags out in the butt or shows all of my bra or whatever that is. This is your replacement. This is the dress you want. All right. Another fun dress that feels probably terrifying when you see this. And for anybody who's not a real tennis or pickleball player, you're like, where am I wearing this to? Again, <clears throat> you're wearing this to get coffee. Or you're wearing this on your Saturday morning play date. Or me and my family have a membership to the zoo. And sometimes when you don't want to think about, this is why I love a jumpsuit, when you don't want to think about your outfit, you want to have bra-friendly coverage, you want to be able to walk through the parks, but you don't want your whole life exposed, this is the beautiful thing about this little tennis dress. Okay, has that like biker Spanx version of the short underneath, so it's just gonna keep you protected from the shaping. Skirt hides everything, has great shape, bra friendly, and just, again, that nod to this tennis trend that's happening, which I think is really fun and preppy, but this is just basically an updated version, like an updated, more preppier version, more of a nod to that tennis sport court trend than this one. So. Does the exact same thing, just has a little bit more bells and whistles. And again, would be really fun if you are packing for Disney. Because again, it has the shorts underneath. So if you don't like like the sweat in the legs happening, get this dress because it's got the shorts. And then again, how cute would this be? Sunnies, these Burks, and you're set to go. And you guys, if you don't have anything from Barley, I think their performance wear, like when I say performance wear, I just mean you're sweating. <laughs> like I'm not physically working out in it. The quality is incredible. You can wash it, eyeline dry, all this kind of like more performance fabrications. And it has lasted me, when I say years, I mean like three years, but um, because I've only owned Barley for three years, but it's incredible. Okay, one more dress that I wanna talk about. Oh, there's so many things. I'm so sorry, I'm like gonna try to rush through this. Check out this fun sport court vision. So if these feel too short, you don't like to expose your legs, you don't want to show the back of your knees, we all know what we're talking about there. This is a really fun, easy breezy version that's a little bit longer. You guys, it is so lightweight. This is from Sweaty Betty. This color is so incredible in this tomato. We also have it in the black, which is selling like crazy. Sorry, now I have a haircut on my eyelash, so bear with me as I touch my face. Okay, we got it. But this is this fun, new little tomato color sports bra. Back to your Birkenstock and you're set to go. This feels like a winner winner for packing on vacation. You go from the pool, you go tote around town, whatever it is. This is crazy lightweight and it's got this like little feminine ruffle on the back. So just a fun nod to that sport court and I think this color is absolutely amazing on everyone. All right, one more tennis skirt. I have to show you guys because we have another really fun brand that's kind of playing into the sport court. Um, oh, see, I'm so excited. I have another thing too I have to talk to you before we get off, of, get off of here. Okay, really fun set from Beyond Yoga. So Beyond Yoga is newer to us in this past year. The fabrications are absolutely incredible. Like softness, like you might want to wear this to bed. But a really fun little tangerine sport court skirt back to this athletic top. 
I don't know about you, but Saturday morning ritual when it gets warm up, we just literally go for a walk. We just got a coffee shop in town, so I can go walk up there. You just want to be cute, pulled together. This is your jam. If you are actually doing something athletic, you could probably, or you're physically doing tennis, you can wear this as well. But just a really fun nod. I think this pop of color is so fun. And if you're going on vacation, I'm gonna say Disney 17 more times too. This would be an awesome combo to bring to Disney. Because even if you wanted to wear a little athletic short and not the skirt, you could pair it back to that. If you wanted to do that with an easy little breezy graphic tee or one of our perfect white tees because you got sunburned the first day, that would be really fun. But I love this together so good together okay last last piece as i'm looking around before i say that last piece to be talking about is our oh and it she's exposing a lot right here this scout jumpsuit from every all right so head on to eetv go check out mel's style curve she gives you all the details on why this jumpsuit is all the amazing things. She also shows you two ways she's styling this, especially if she's packing on vacation. Airplane to kind of that happy hour look. This jumpsuit is all the things. Again, and more of that performance fabric. So if it gets wet, you're totally set to go. If you're sweating, you're not gonna be like soaked in sweat. That's so graphic already for a Thursday morning. Um, this is the Scout Wide Leg Jumpsuit. Fits so many body types. Draw string waistline so you can adjust it. Bra friendly, I might have said that 17 times. Pockets, this is just a home run. We've had it in before. We have an amazing scout program. And this jumpsuit, again, is just that really great spring, summer basic you're gonna want in your wardrobe because it's really gonna take you from like that nine to five, five to nine, all the summer things. So this scout jumps in so good. If you wanna see it on a real body, go to EETV, check out Mel's Style Curve, and she showed you all the ways to do this. Um, are there any questions? Oh, Jamie's like, let's talk about these bags because they're really fun. So I like, I have one more thing. All right, fun new accessory happening for spring. Check out these new little market fisherman totes from Every. I'm like, where am I gonna go? How cute would this red version be with my outfit? Going to the market, come on farmer's markets, let's open back up, let's get the snow gone so we can go back out. This is the Ren Crochet Bag, $68. Fun little red, great little easy breezy neutral. How easy is this to pack in your suitcase? Like one and done, so if you have the pool toys in here, you wanna throw towels, you throw a book, whatever it is gonna be, this bag is gonna be such an easy breezy toss in with everything that you have. But like, how cute is it? Really lightweight, fun by every, all in this like cotton fabrication, but really fun new accessory to add to your spring wardrobe. Okay, so I know I was gonna talk to you about spring uniforms, but everything on this wrap is really exciting. So I think I just talked about all the individual pieces, but crew, I am, do you have questions before I wrap up here? Sorry, as I'm like, Moving through all of it. Recap your outfit real quick. Oh, recap my outfit real quick. Like recap it and maybe bag it up and bring it home because it's so good. As a reminder, this is that drapey denim shirt from Good American. I'm wearing a size three. I am a true large, sometimes a medium in top. Feels so yummy. Love the little camp shirt details with the two pockets. Really fun stitching. Wearing it back to these AG. These are the Sage wide legs. I'm wearing a size 30s, which is a size 10. I can't tell you how unbelievably stretchy they are. They're so yummy. They sit really high. Here's my belly button. Here's the top of the jeans. And then these crazy fun platforms, cork platforms from Jeffrey Campbell. So fun. And then this, I have to make a call for this. This is my Yoriana little beaded Turk. So, so fun if you want to stack all the necklaces, which is another big trend. But that's for another, another story, another reel coming your way about necklace stacking. So this was so fun. Thank you for letting me spend your time with you on a Thursday. I almost said a Monday because I never go live on Thursdays. But I think this is Heidi's best place is to go through the entire rack so you can hear all the amazing education that Heidi always shares. But it was so fun to spend the day with you and I hope you all have a really great weekend. If you are headed on spring break, so many goodies for you to pack with and come on warm weather. Let's get here so we can wear all the amazing new spring goods. Bye crew.